lose you, everything is gonna be okay. Now I have no idea. What do you mean? Even lying to me about what? I want to believe in Jared's innocence with all my heart, but I'm telling you, that's all I've got to go on because, I mean, the fact is, I barely even know my own son until we reconnected here in Landview. Jared and I were practically strangers. Hey, what if, where's Natalie? Uh, Natalie's with her husband. Why? Is Taya with them? No. Natalie couldn't find Taya. I figured you guys had gone on a honeymoon. Yeah. Why? Is something wrong? What happened? I just found out that my lovely bride has been keeping a whopper of a secret from me. Jared, tell me what's going on. Those calls that were made to my phone. The ones that you were supposedly getting from the dead guy? Those calls. They... they... I'm stopping my account. What about those phone calls? Mr. Banks. Yeah. William Sheridan. Your daughter-in-law called me about representing your son? Yeah, of course. I, um... Vicky, if you can... No, no, no. I'll, be, I'll wait right here. You go ahead. Yeah. I'll be here. What happened? Well, my marriage is over. What? Yeah, it's kaput. It's... It's just... It's over before it even started, literally. Uh, apparently, Taya's not even legally my wife. What do you mean? She already has a husband. This guy named Ross Rayburn, who actually did some work for me before. Did Taya tell you this? No. Actually. Who did? Blair. And I just confirmed that... Taya and Rayburn got married in Tahiti, and it's still current up. What? It's got to be a mistake. Yeah, the mistake was falling in love with her again, now apparently. Come, come on, this can't be right. Taya's a lawyer. Bigamy is against the law. She would never knowingly be married to two men at the same time. You know, she did give me some crap about it. How she thought she was divorced, but... Well, then that explains it, doesn't it? But then why would she never mention the ex-husband from the first place? Because you're a crazy, jealous person, and I'm sure she was afraid of how you were going to react, even though the relationship is obviously over. No, 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 no. No, she knew that I had changed, and she still didn't trust me. I mean, listen, if, if, if she's willing to hide things like a marriage from me, what else is she hiding? Well, Jared was just saying what he's been saying all along, which is that he doesn't know who or why someone's making the phone calls to him that he's never met. Hmm. Well, I have a few more questions for Jared. Okay, go ahead. Natalie. I'm not going anywhere. Natalie. I'm his wife. It's okay, really. I'll be okay. Don't let him railroad you. I won't. Okay, let's get this over with. What do you want to know? This is a list of visitors Wayne Landers had in prison from the time of your release. If my name's on that list, it's a crock. I didn't know the guy, I never visited the guy, and I sure as hell didn't step foot back in that hellhole after I was released. I made a promise that I wouldn't go back there, ever, and I intend to keep it. Good. Now look at the list, and let me know if you recognize any of the names. So, so my son hasn't formally been charged with, um, uh, murder. And that's good, right? Well, they can hold him for a while without charging him. Oh, yeah, so they still could? Look, if my son has done something that but is in I'm it... sorry. You and I can't have that conversation if we're going to help him. Right, right, of course. Yeah. So what did Taya tell you about this previous marriage? You did let her explain, didn't you? Why are you defending her? I'm not defending her. I'm asking you a question. And the other thing is you didn't act very surprised when I told you about this. Did she tell you? No, she did not tell me. She said she had something she needed to tell you, but not what it was. Well, that's your cue to come to me about it. Well, I'm sorry I don't operate that way. She confided something in me. I encouraged her to tell you, and she said she wanted to. Come on, she was very troubled. Yeah, I imagine Big and me's very troubling. Todd, she wanted to tell you everything. I know that. She probably just wanted to wait till your wedding night was over so it would be perfect, because for Pete's sake, she loves you. 
And this is how you show someone you love them? Is this? You're not even giving her a chance to explain. God, I don't need another one of your lectures. I'm just going to find her. And what do you what do you intend to do when you find her? Move, Blair. I'm more... Nope. Look again. Someone might have used an assumed name. Oh, someone like me. You're not helping yourself by acting like this. What do you want me to do? something. You know it and I know it. The way I see it, you got two choices. You tell me your story and I do what I can to help you. Or you keep it to yourself and it keeps you company in prison. Don't Oop. say another word, Mr. Banks. Jerry, this is William Sheridan. Natalie hired him to represent you. I'll need to confer with my client in private. Good luck. You know, Vicky, you don't have to wait here for me. Oh, come on. There is nowhere else that I want to be. You want me to help you? You're going to have to be completely honest with me. Did you kill Wayne Landers? I thought... Everything I just told you was confidential, correct? Well, I'm prevented by law from sharing it with anyone. Good. Because no one else can find out. If you want to continue this conversation, you'll have to do it from the cell. Are you charging him? We have the right to hold him for 48 hours, and you know it. I'm sorry. Let's go. You're starting to doubt him, aren't you? No. No, not at all. 